It's the holidays. I want that evidence on my desk first thing in the morning. Hey, Kelsey girl. Like I said, first thing in the morning. Good day, Councilor Mitchell. Hey, George, how's it going? Good, pretty much. Running around in the season of giving, so I decided to give the world holiday cards. <laughs> what are you up to, shopping? Oh no, this season has no grip on me. The holidays are just another reason for big corporations to exploit, overcharge, and negate actual suffering. And all people do is feed into it, overdo and overspend, and they're fake during this jolly holiday. Girl, we'll take the tingle up out of your bed. I'm sorry, I'm just not really into it. I got better things to do. Like what? Get ready for next year. Everybody's so busy running around this time of year that they let everything fall apart. Kelsey, you work so hard. Sometimes even you need to relax. Let your hair down. Kick back for a minute. I'll pass. You know your brother's having a party tonight. Don't tell me you're not going. <laughs> then I won't tell you. Kelsey. Look, Trent, I love you, but I really don't have time for this. I'm going to stop by and see Josh like I do every year. But other than that, fuck I'll see you later, Trent. Uh, that girl's needs some joy in her holidays. Ooh, that a cute. Hey girl, where'd you get those from? Uh, thank you so much for delivering my treat to my truck. Oh, my pleasure. Yeah. Hope you're having a good holiday so far. So far? So uh, far so good? Well, this tree is gorgeous. Can you tell me about it? This is a Fraser. It came from North Carolina. These smell the best. Just get it here. Going in at an angle. Yeah. Well, hope you have a Merry Christmas and everything. You too, but hey, awesome. is there any way that I can say hi to Mr. Jingles? He's a fictional polar bear. Go ahead, say hi. No Appreciate it. Have a good one. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. It's that time of year, everybody gather around, gonna spread some cheer. Good, after the time that we had this year, I could really use a change in the atmosphere. I call Marcus and Kelsey and Justin and Chris, Alex is bringing the dip. Let's make a party out of it. Do, 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 do. Who could that be? I don't know, let's see. I don't care, but I hope they got something to eat. I'm coming home for the holidays. I just can't wait to celebrate. Now, Josh, please do not drink all the eggnog this year. What was said? What was said was, do not drink all the eggnog this year, Josh. Hey, brother. <sighs> You're cooking this year, right? He better be. That's the only reason I'm here. Really, Marcus? We well, got, yeah, you know, and Christmas stuff. I can't with you. Hey, guys. So glad you made it. Come on in. Let's live it up. Later. Marcus, save me some! 
Deuxièmement, c'est ce que je Now that's a reindeer. What did you do to Woody? She cute, ain't she? No! She looked like she about to do an album with Nick Cannon. That wall looks kind of bare over there. Is that tinsel? Trent, no, no! Oh my, Josh. Chris? Hi. What's up with the only gift under the tree? Oh, that's Kelsey. Kelsey's. Yeah, Josh puts the same gift under the tree every year. Hopefully she'll come around. Come around for what? Yeah, does she not tell the way I like this? She does. It's not this one. Why? What happened? I guess I'm all sorry. Yes, 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 yes. Check out my new sweater. Right? Right, right. It's amazing, right? Oh, uh, it's festive. Right? It's you, bro. I think it's ugly and it should be burned at the stake. Marcus! What? It's my favorite new sweater. It would be. Let's go get some egg on. That's something. Yeah. yeah, we need to work on here. Trevor, can you come in here, please? Trevor, can you come in here, please? Not simple fix. No more vacations December 1st through January 2nd. Oh, man. No, Kelsey, we do not have time to rest like everybody else. We need to get this finished. Josh, boys, come on in. Josh? Where's Kelsey? of Christmas past, but you can call me Sir Pat. <laughs> okay, whatever. What? Me popping up all over the place doesn't convince you? No, I just don't have time to be lucid dreaming about the past with people who don't exist. <gasps> For sure! Does it exist? How have you say, madam? I am no imaginary friend. Ooh. It was cute as a village. What's that in his hand? I don't know. Josh loved this time holiday. And where were you? In my room, as usual. And why weren't you celebrating with the others? Do you see who else is not celebrating with the others? Who? Mom and Dad. And where are you going? To check on someone who's feeling extremely lonely right now. You might not like what you find. Kelsey? I know you don't recognize my voice, but I'm, I'm a friend of your Uncle Anthony's. You're probably busy right now organizing your January schedule. I always remember doing that. I just want you to know that mom and dad, your mom and dad, they love you very much. And they're on the way. You just gotta keep your head up. It gets easier to ignore. Kelsey? Oh! 
Looking for you. Yeah, she went to the potter. Top notch speech, though. Stop doing that. What? Because I just want to be left alone. Doesn't seem that way to me. <sighs> Look, I'm alone every Christmas. It's how it's always been, and it's how it always will be. Young lady, did you not see what happened downstairs? Hun, you have to listen. The past has a way of holding on to you. You can run, 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 it comes back to ya. And I know times like this you just wanna dismiss. But you can't move on if you only forget. You gotta let go. Try this. The little joy inside you won't show up. The little girl who finally had enough will never see the forest for the trees that you keep burning. All of the leaves, life wasn't so bad, and you had love in your grave. just fine when you take me back to my office. Seriously? <sighs> Very well. Oh. Oh, where's Johnny? Um, I had to call Marcus. I'll never believe Oh no! It's my day off. Fine. She better not give me any trouble. Good luck with that. Stop it, pass. Stop it. Chris, is that you? Mm, oops. Left the wall again. Nope, not Chris, but I can see why you can have us fabulously confused. So if you're not Chris, then let me guess. You are... I'm the ghost of Christmas present. Oh, great, I haven't woke up yet. Exactly. I'm here to get you woke. Great. Let's get to it. Chop chop. Oh, right. What the? Am I floating? How? So full of questions. Is that why you don't have any holiday cheer? Just always so filled with questions? Always questioning everything? I'm a lawyer. I have to question everything. Especially why I'm daydreaming about my friends who are as fairies distracting me from my responsibilities. <laughs> For a lawyer, you aren't that good when the answer's right in front of your face. Dude, how come you just don't give her this gift? Because Kelsey doesn't celebrate Christmas? That doesn't mean you don't give her gifts. True, and I give her gifts all the time. Celebration gifts, birthday gifts, just because I love her gifts. But that gift specifically, I got her for Christmas a long time ago. And I'm not one to push my beliefs onto other people. So if she doesn't celebrate, she don't celebrate. See, my brother gets it. Now let's go. Keep watching. Why'd she hate Christmas? I have no idea. Christmas was amazing growing up. We got to go to Uncle Anthony's every single year. He would teach us to bake cookies. Then we get to open up two gifts. One of them was always PJs, of course. But then we would watch Charlie Brown's Christmas. Then we would eat the cookies until we were sick. Then me and my cousins would go to bed and we'd wake up and there's a whole bunch of gifts. Like, it's amazing. Man, Uncle Anthony does sound amazing. Right? It was. Until he passed. And that's why I celebrate this year this holiday with 
my friends and family. Well, and if I just hope one day Chelsea can come and celebrate with me, and I can give her this. You're a good brother, man. I'll try. So are you. Yeah, I could be a better one. And we could all be better siblings to each other. Come on! Um, I probably forgot to take the yeah, chicken out. Oh, don't wish you See, Josh understands. If I want to work my holidays away, I can. Mm -hmm. See, I'll show you. Put me Look! Down. You have to pay attention and stop running away from the truth! Whatever happened to you, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Look. I got something to show you. Listen up. You got a smile. Forget about the past and turn it all around. I said you got to know that everything you want is all yours to hold. I said don't be afraid that everything you want is on Christmas Day. So take my hand. To see it for yourself, this ain't no fairy tale. Just no. believe in me and know that everything will come back to you. Just believe in me and go to sleep and wake up to your promised dreams. Just believe in me. You gotta believe in you. You better believe in me. You'll see. Just wake up, Kelsey. Now I understand you've been through a lot in your life, but you must know this. Ain't nobody got time for that, baby. <laughs> Look, you gotta believe in yourself when the present day comes, right? Candy cane, <laughs> gingerbread. <laughs> but don't you get it? Don't. We, we can do this. We can do this. Believe. <laughs> believe in me And know that everything will come back to you Just believe in me And go to sleep and wake up to your promised dreams Just believe in me You gotta believe in you You better believe in me You'll see Just wake up Kelsey I've never fallen asleep at work before. Must have been those brownies Josh made. It wasn't the brownies I was And you are? Oh, I know you're not Kavan. Correct. I'm not Kavan. See? She's learning. Stop interrupting. Okay, so past, present, future. Prolific future. Mm. But yes, future. It's a pleasure. Maybe for you. Look, I don't have time for this right now, so you can go ahead and poof yourself out of here. Thank you. Ugh, what is it with you guys and the singing? It's in the job description. You can keep your attitude and think that things won't change Or you can lighten up and find the joy you've never claimed The time we have is precious, so enjoy it all today Cause tomorrow is not promised, just today Today Cause tomorrow is not promised, just today 
Listen up, Miss Fields, I'm telling you. Reality check is coming through. This life you neglect is going to change. Big deal, whatever, anyways. You can keep your attitude and think that things will change. Or you can lighten up and find the joy you never claimed. This time we have is precious, so enjoy it all today. Cause tomorrow is not promised, just today. Cause tomorrow is not promised, just today! <laughs> I've had enough, I'm telling you. You can hit the bricks, I'm through with you. Am I singing? I'm going insane! You're not losing your brain, you've got a choice. Be the coldest, richest, baddest of all, or lose your voice. Appreciate the ones you love before they're gone. The song is to remind you what you've known all along. Show me when I die and how sad everybody is, but then show me how good my nonprofit is doing so that I can lie in peace knowing that my life meant something. Well? No, I normally don't enjoy this part of the journey, but this one, I think I will. someone that we care about very much. They were taken away from us too soon. I can't even imagine going on without their shining personality just to brighten up my day. Well, this is, this is actually kind of sweet. So, so sweet. Kelsey. I'm so sorry. What? What? No, no, this is this is not how it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be. Watch. You'll see how. Um... So sorry. I wanted to apologize. I, Josh was talking to me about this and he said he wanted to give it to you. Then he went out to drive and the ice, the truck. It's like... I wanted you to have this and I think that you should look at it.
I guess it's time. You're supposed to be prolific future! What is so prolific and fruitful about this, huh? Tell me! Tell me! Tell me! Tell me! <laughs> Every tree must be watered and careful it's to bear fruit. If left neglected, it will die. Why are you putting that up there? You never know who's gonna come over. With it being Christmas, miracles. Kelsey's not coming, bro. Actually, I'm about to leave and take her to prison. Pushing your ideologies? Nope. Not even gonna say Merry Christmas. Happy holidays? No. Just gonna run in, chuck it at her, run out as fast as I can. That's, that's a good idea. I thought so. You don't mind uh, bringing her back in tow? <laughs> yes, I do. I can't. I gotta go. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Chicka 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 chicka. <laughs> Drive safe. You know I will. I'm watering my tree! I'm watering my tree! I'm watering my tree! My tree! Oh, my nose! Josh, I'm so sorry. Oh. Oh. I'm so happy you're okay. Uh, are you okay? What's this about a tree? Oh. Miracles, man. Miracles. <laughs> really, Marcus? You gotta admit, that was funny. <laughs> you do look like Rudolph. Okay! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Thank you so much, Marcus. Oh. 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 Okay. What is going on here? Did you just come here driving through all that ice? Weren't you about to do the same? How do you know that? I know the future. Look at this play out. Look, I'm just glad you're here to celebrate Christmas. No. Us. As long as I don't have to participate in the obsessive gift buying, star thing, and real time caroling, I will at least spend the day with you. Okay. Hot chocolate? Yes, please. Marshmallows? Yes. I love marshmallows. Oh, Mitzi, I want some popcorn. I'm gonna make a car. Y'all talk. We'll be back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nice job. <laughs> Look, it's been around a while, okay? brother. Kelsey, you can't sue your brother over Christmas gifts. We, we did good. We did a good job. We do teach Bible lessons. Messed up ones, but Bible nonetheless. Yeah, we do. That is a legend. What was that? Oh, shut up, present. Uh, Come along, you two. in this house somewhere. I just know it. Are we really looking for an earring? We're not gonna like how this ends. I didn't like how it begun. 
Not today. Chris, Marcus, come on. What are you three doing? Listen it up. We're coming home for the home.